Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Dear viewers, today we will model complex surface in AutoCAD. Then we will import complex surfaces in Autodesk Robot Structural Analysis 2021. Before going to that, I want to tell about the website of Decode BD. You can go to the website by typing decode-bd.com. From here, you can check tutorial page here there will be new uploads and other featured tutorials linked to YouTube resources the resources we have used in YouTube tutorials here you will get those resources and some other useful resources you will get here then you can go to discussion page for asking any questions here you can type your question i will try to give the answer you can see the blog in the blog i will try to post important articles every day so you can check the blog now we will go to the tutorial So let's start. First, I will go to 3D view. From here, I will model a line 0, 0, origin point. Height, I will take 8 meter. Then this side, I will take 12, 8. Now here I will copy 2 meter to draw curve line along this plan we need to change the UCS go to here new UCS from here this direction X and this direction Y now go to curve line like this I'll make mirror from here to here I'll take offset 3 meter extend up to this then I'll trim this one Now this one I will copy from here to here, here, this one I will make mirror like this. Now this one I will copy along this direction 10 meter, along this direction also I will make curve line so first I'll draw this line I'll copy this one along this direction 1 meter I will make curve line along this plan so I'll rotate this UCS X this direction and Y this direction so now from here, here, and here. This one I'll copy from here to here, 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 and in the middle also. this one so this is the outline of our surface go to 3d modeling here surface we have to keep selected surface associativity and nerves creation these two will be 
gift selected then go to loft this one to this one like this then enter right click guides this one now same way repeat loft enter guide this one and here we can change the division right click here 6 by 6 here we can make it 4 by 6 6 by 4 or make it 6 by 2 like this this one also properties 6 by 2 we can see in realistic view also like this now we can create meshing now select the surfaces go to mesh here I will go for triangular mesh 1.2 meter by 1.2 meter meshing size 40 degree maximum angle between new faces click on ok create mesh like this now this members we can delete now I will select all then CO enter like this CO from here to here okay so this is our complex surface this members we can change layer as members and the surfaces to surface layer now we can delete this zero layer isolate and isolate this surface I'll select and I will explode them X enter so this surface is exploded now I will save this one close this now I will open robot structural analysis new project from here go to job preference unit metric yes save current parameters as default yes okay now I will open this CAD file here you will see RTD file type from here we will change to DWG format select this one click on open click OK OK here you can see meter kilonewton unit now we will go to geometry panel object list from here we will select the object now here we can change the reinforcement RCC shell 
thickness from here we can change and model type shell thickness we will change 150 one five centimeter here material we can change strength here it is in 4 ksi click on add close now click on add it will take time because number of panels are 5620 now this is finished we can see here now we will assign this members to section new 30 by 30 30 centi by 30 centi add apply close now here we will select edit select bar undefined selected undefined bars press delete so now the undefined members or bars deleted only the shell elements are available here and we can assign support for this columns support fixed apply close and this members we can as column we can see the section we can display the thickness of panel like this display thickness i don't want to see now okay i will select all the shell elements then i will assign load self weight add date load add live load add now close now we will select the shell elements then load definition surface surface uniform planar load here it is in kpa that means kilopascal one kilopascal equal to one kilonewton per meter square meter so here i will go for global direction minus two add this is now case number three live load now it will be assigned as live load apply assigned now i'll select dead load one kilonewton per meter square surface one add apply close this one from here we can see the loading symbol and loading value now we can go for analysis calculation now we can go for result maps 
here you can see the stresses principal stresses this is for self weight dead load life load stresses along direction 2 moment global displacement y z this is color scale color pattern basic blue green 256 here we can see the shear force and bending moment by cutting the panel panel cut between two point um, here to here apply and we can see the diagram field apply here, here is the diagram where we have cut the plan and click on moment to from panel cut we can see moment from here m11 m12 like this we can see value also text here is the text section cut a a1 here you can see top reinforcement also bottom reinforcement also section cuts we can delete from here apply close so in this way we can import complex model from AutoCAD to Autodesk Robot Structural Analysis and then we can go for analysis and design. We can go for model geometry, remove the analytical view, here we can display panel panel counter we can remove counter component we can remove to see the panels smoothly So thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more upcoming important tutorials. Press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update.